Okay, let's wrap this up. Remember, a CBC is just short for a complete blood count. And a CBC will help us identify the current white blood cell count, red blood cell count, and platelet counts, and the hemoglobin and hematocrit levels. So we can learn a lot from this one lab test. Now, it requires a blood sample from the patient and always put it in a purple top tube. Now, when you're going to draw blood for the sample, try to look for an arm that doesn't have IV fluids flowing in it as well, if at all possible. If you do have to draw it, remember, draw from beneath the site. Now, always compare your lab results with the patient's history, medication, and hands-on physical assessment. Now, I want to stop and go over that point again. Remember, a lab test is nothing more than a bunch of numbers unless you do the work of a nurse and compare those lab results with what you see going on with your patient. Look at their history, their medications, and your assessment for the most accurate interpretations of any lab value. Thank you for watching our video today.